Most ant colonies begin with a mating flight, when winged virgin queen and male ants of the same species leave their parent colonies in large swarms, find each other by smell, and mate. Shortly or immediately thereafter, the male ant dies, but the new queen lands, tears her wings off with her hind legs, and starts looking for a place to hide. She will usually find or dig a small concealed space, where she will lay her first clutch of eggs. In time, the eggs will mature to larvae, which she will feed with nutrients stored in her body, or in some cases, by gathering food from outside. The larvae become pupae and finally adult worker ants. The new workers take over all the responsibilities of tending the young, building and defending the nest, and finding food, leaving the queen to focus entirely on laying eggs, which she will do continuously for the rest of her life. The colony grows until eventually, when the number of workers is high enough, different types of ants begin to be born. These are the males and new queens, and, like their parents before them, they develop wings, so that when the time comes, they can take mating flights of their own and found new colonies, beginning the process all over again.